Departing from his usual black or navy suits, Kim gave his televised speech wearing black rimmed glasses and slicked back hair, speaking fluently and rarely looking down to read as he raised the possibility of sending a delegation to the upcoming Winter Olympics in South Korea. In this New Year's address, North Korea seems to have taken great pains with the image portrayed by Kim Jong-un, said an analysis by the state-run Korea Institute for National Unification after Kim's speech. The change from the Kim's previous dark Maoist suits to a softer toned grey western style suit likely aimed to underpin peace which Kim stressed in his address, and reflected a relaxed state of mind that probably came with the completion of the North's nuclear power, the institute said. After a year dominated by fiery rhetoric and escalating tensions over Pyongyang's nuclear weapons program, the North Korean leader declared his country a peace-loving and responsible nuclear power and called for lower military tensions and improved ties with the South. Kim also said he was open to dialogue with Seoul, prompting South Korea on Tuesday to propose high-level talks between the two countries on January 9 at the border truce village of Pamujeom.